In other news, former U.S. President Donald Trump has been inducted by a federal grand jury for allegedly mishandling classified government documents and obstruction of justice. The criminal case brought by the U.S. Department of Justice amounts to another legal setback for Trump as he seeks to regain the U.S. presidency next year. Donald Trump already faces a criminal case in New York that is due to go to trial in March. Now, the indictment remains under seal and even Trump himself has not yet seen what it says. His legal team was notified about the seven charges as part of a summons ordering Trump to appear in court. Meanwhile, Trump reacted to the news calling the case box hoax. Very sadly, we're a nation in decline and yet they go after a popular president, a president that got more votes than any sitting president in the history of our country by far, and did much better the second time in the election than the first. And they go after him on a boxer's hoax, just like the Russia, Russia, Russia hoax, and all of the others. This has been going on for seven years. They can't stop because it's election interference at the highest level. There's never been anything like what's happened. I'm an innocent man. I'm an innocent person. Uh, they had the Mueller hoax, the Mueller report, and that came out, no collusion after two and a half years that was set up by Hillary Clinton and Democrats. But this is what they do. This is what they do so well. If they would devote their energies to honesty and integrity, it would be a lot better for our country. They could do a lot better. They could do a lot of great things. Because you notice, I have never once, not one single time, suggested to the Justice Department what they should do or not do relative to bringing a charge or not bringing a charge. I'm honest. All right, that's all we have for you in this edition. Thank you very much for watching, but stay tuned to Perlo.